Hi and welcome to Aquatic Mike. Today I'm bringing you another fry development development video. This time around we'll be taking a look at Cordoras similis or similis. Here we've got the fry at the age of seven days. Uh, they're currently in a 40 liter tank. In the current clip uh, we'll be taking a look on several batches of them that I've raised throughout the video but and uh, the tank is basically just a tank with some Ramson snail sand and a large sponge filter uh, as you can see they've been given or well they've been given mic worms and uh, homemade gelf food throughout their development till around about two months um, <coughs> here we've got the fry at one month old and uh, it's a tank with the same size uh, but slightly better lit uh, and as you can see they're starting to resemble their parents uh, it's just a bu bunch of Ramson snails and the large sponge filter in here. Corridoras similis or similis originates from uh, Brazil, the state uh, Rondonia, uh, in the vicinity of uh, the city called Ariquemes and the Madeira River uh, system and uh, they're a lineage 9 fish similar looking species are for example Cordoras guapor which is a lineage 4 fish Corridoras spectabilis which is a lineage 8 fish uh, Corridoras urostigma which is a lineage 1 fish and uh, Corridoras C66, which is uh, one of the ones that more resembles similis in my opinion, but uh, it's a lineage 8 fish. And then you've got Corridoras caudimaculatus, which is also a lineage 9 fish, but uh, Corridoras caudimaculatus is a bit more stockier in its body, like um, they're not that hard to. Uh, differentiate if you've got uh, the two species and uh, compare the two to one another and here we've got the fry at two months old now they're looking just like their parents and they're still uh, in the same tank here uh, we'll be taking a look on another batch of them soon uh, in another tank that's slightly smaller and with uh, slightly worse lightning, I suppose. But uh, Cordura similis, uh, you can keep them around about 24 degrees Celsius, uh, plus minus a couple of degrees. I keep mine that I breed uh, in the lower pot. Um, they're uh, friendly corridors, just like pretty much any other corridors. I suppose there's a couple of lineage one fish that might uh, spar between the males, and uh, the males may also chase the females quite a bit within lineage one or certain species within lineage one but other than that and Sleromystax species that might spar a little bit as well the majority of them are rather friendly and even the lineage one fish and the Sleromystax will only like uh, spar between themselves they won't bother other fish either and here we've got the other batch in the other tank that is slightly worse lightning on but as you can see they're thriving here as well. This is a slightly smaller uh, tank, but uh, 
yeah and it's uh, well comprised of pretty much the same things just uh, sand uh, ram's horns melts and large bond filter um, suppose that it I don't think I had any other fry in this one uh, Cordura Simless in the trades, also known as the Violet Corridoras or Smudge Spot Corridoras, if you hear either of the trade names. And here we've got another fry that I raced with some Corridoras Panda in another tank. Suppose this one's the largest one, he outgrew the rest. And well, Probably because he's slightly older than the Cordoas Panda. The Cordoas Panda in this tank aren't two months like the Cordoas Similis, but yeah. Mm. And here we've got uh, another batch of Cordoas Similis. Another 40 liter tank, I think. Here they are at uh, six months old. And uh, now they're all ready to be. To find uh, new homes, I guess, or to be uh, left to an aquarium store. There's a cord or a CW10 in the background as well. And uh, in this video, I did something, or I intend to do something different with the sound. We'll see whether if it turns out well, but uh, if that's the case, I might do that in the future as well. Let me know what you think, and thank you for sticking with me so far. Uh, please like, comment, subscribe, share, and I'll catch you in the next one. Take care.